Welcome back to Wiseman Company, everybody. I'm Ben, and today we're going to be talking about the Invert Bandolier from IC13 Arms. When this concept was originally explained to me and I saw the first prototype, I thought it was pretty stupid. I had a notion that the social media community wouldn't really ex accept this piece of gear. It looks different, it's kind of nerdy, but after using it quite a bit, I, I really like it actually, it, it works. Uh, we're gonna get into the details of it, what it's made of, uh, how I use it in particular. As you can see, my setup right here is for a CZ Scorpion or a subgun setup. Typically when you buy the full package from IC13 Arms, it's sold as a rifle AR-15 package. Um, you can see I have mine all pouched out here, uh, but you can buy it slick. Um, and I don't want to take all these pouches out off right now, and if I had another one, I'd show you. Oh. This is a slick version. This is how it comes um, if you don't get the full kit. Um, there are six rows of PALS webbing on here, and it uses a mixture of 500D and 1000D Cordura in its construction, so it averages out to about a 750D Cordura. All right, the invert is designed to be worn um, like a bandolier. It just is a sling, basically. You, you dive through with one arm and your mags hang upside down. You don't have to run it like this, but this is where you're gonna get some advantages uh, on reloads and accessibility to all your gear. Right now I have two G-Code Scorpion pouches on here uh, holding my CZ Scorpion mags. I have a Lunar Concepts uh, TQ carrier and then the Lunar Concepts, Concepts Swift pack on here for some medical. The whole rig is uh, made by Lunar Concepts, and as you know, he's uh, a friend of Wiseman Company and he makes high quality stuff. Uh, I run Lunar Concepts slings on all my rifles. Uh, if you're interested in one of those, um, I'll leave a link down to his uh, IG down below. So, I'm sure everyone's main concern is, do the mags fall out because they're upside down? The answer is no. Even with these G-Code pouches, um, full mags, loaded up, heavyweight, they stay in there running, jumping, rolling around. I've never had a mag fall out. With the rifle setup, I've never had a mag fall out either. The retention on those is extremely stout. Um, they hold those mags in tight and they also provide a bungee for an extra layer um, retention if you want to use it, but a lot of people don't uh, just because the retention is already so good in the uh, mag pouches that you get from IC-15 arms. So like I said in the beginning, this is a great piece of kit to slip on. It goes on very quickly. You can just dive right through it. It does have another strap on it if you want some more stability. And you can tuck that, roll that up if you don't want to use it. I typically don't. But if you wanted some more stability here, you can attach that right there and this rig isn't going anywhere. If you don't want to use it, just roll it back up and you can just wear it sling style. I really like this because it keeps it fast, it keeps it uh, easy to fold up if you're putting it in a bag. I think this is the best way to have it, but this is a good option. Reloading from the invert, I think, is its strongest asset. It puts your mags right close, right in your workspace, and it makes it very quick and very simple to use. Final thoughts on the invert, it has everything you need as far as a responsible citizen goes, and even if you are a a law enforcement officer, I think you should take a look at this rig. Holding two mags, whether it's pistol or rifle, and some um, medical is probably all you really need in the day-to-day -day grind, and it's quick to put on, and it doesn't take up a lot of space when you're storing it. I know I said I didn't like this piece of kit in the beginning and after time and using it a lot and running some other versions, I've really grown to like it. If you go to some of the other accounts out there, you can see other people using this and again, you can customize this any way you want, set it up for your needs. If you wanted to run medical only, you could totally do that. If you wanted to set this up for handgun, you could also do that. Again, you can buy it slick or you can buy it in that rifle configuration from IC13 Arms. Guys, if you like this video, hit that like button. Please go check us out on Facebook and Instagram. We got a lot of great content going on over there. And you can ask any questions on anything you see there. We'll get to it as quickly as we can. If you want to support Wise Men Company, go to wisemencompany.com. We have a lot of good stuff over there, swag, EDC gear. Check it out. It's a great way to support us, and we appreciate it. 
Guys, thank you for watching. We'll see you on the next video.